Hello, Gary Perkins, HCPC Paramedic from Sussex First Aid Courses. I would like to spend a couple minutes introducing to you our emergency drugs pack for the dental practice. Indeed, it can be used in medical practices and GP practice, but mainly we've kept the dental practices in mind. That's where we carry out a lot of our CPD work. Over the years, in all my work with dental practices, teaching each time we go there we always check their drugs and medications for them and there's been some great ideas coming up i have the terminology rescue ready is your practice rescue ready by that i mean if there's a medical emergency tomorrow are you able to go to your kit with confidence open up the kit and get the relevant emergency drugs and know the drug dosages to treat your patient there's um high expectation on all of us these days to deliver the correct care and rightly so. With that in mind I've put this kit together and designed it colour-coded to the national standards to work in line with our emergency medical manual. Here's the emergency medical manual I've written myself. You can see the, um, the finished product on our website you can order it on there and just very briefly when you open up the drug kit inside there all your pouches are color coded they're all detachable they're all wipeable to keep clean for your infection control and at the moment if i just take anaphylaxis there you go a yellow page to go with the yellow pouch the whole idea is to reduce the stress each pouch is clearly labeled also in, on the labels, you'll have the what should be inside, the contents. And also on the other side, you have additional equipment that may be needed, i.e. oxygen therapy, resuscitation equipment, worst case scenario. It's all there to try and help you. The kits all together. Here we are, anaphylaxis, chest pains, medical emergencies, heart attacks are red, asthma are blue. Inside there, you'll have your spacer, you'll have your Ventolin. The whole idea, again, is to reduce the stress. Uh, for many practices I have delivered over the years, they've been developing um, uh, different ways of tr trying to make this uh, easier after my talks. And they've done some great work. But what I have seen is that the, the colour coding and, and sometimes the drug dosages and one thing or another have all got a little bit mixed up. And the reality is if someone's just written on the packet, oh, you should give 300, 400 milligrams of aspirin or something like that, whose word are you taking? So it needs to come from the UK Resuscitation Council or the BNF guidelines. And this kit here falls in completely within the guidelines and the up-to-date treatment guidelines so that the, the, there's no chance you're gonna make a mistake. So use the manual, use the color-coded kit, have it ready there in your cupboard. Make sure it's checked each week. Make sure your staff all understand where it is and how to use it. And the whole idea is this color-coded kit will reduce the stress and anxiety of your staff for when it comes to medical emergencies. If you have any other questions regarding this kit, then please do contact us uh, to have a chat. Thank you.